Stefan's been in touch saying, uh, hi, Luke and Pete, going back to Luke's quarrel with his neighbours about putting cones on the street to reserve parking spaces. I wanted to send you this photo. But he says, there's a bloke who lives a couple of streets away from me who puts cones out under the guise of needing round-the-clock access to his jet ski. <laughs> <laughs> like it's some kind of emergency vehicle. <laughs> <laughs> on top of that, he also has two signs permanently in his living room window explaining that if you park there, he will get you towed. I must acknowledge that he has a dropped curb in front of his house, but how the council permitted this is absolutely beyond me. In three yeah. years, I've walked past his house hundreds of times and never once seen the jet ski away from its spot. The bloke living yeah. there in his, is in his 60s. I'm not really sure if he even goes out on it these days anyway. <laughs> Ultimately, I don't think someone living in a small terrace street in central Exeter needs 24-hour access to a jet ski. <laughs> Let but, the man have his jet ski fun. It's night jet skis. Night jet skis. Oh, my deserves God. Deserves a quiet night. <laughs> <laughs> it's an absolutely oh, outrageous flex. Also, yeah. what I would say, based on the definitely. photo, it's just under a big blue sheet, so I don't even know if it is a jet ski. Um, Yeah, it's definitely it's definitely a jet ski. Um, But it's he's ruined the entire front of his house for the sake of a fucking jet ski. Uh, the rest of the terrace houses have their palisade. Is it palisade or palisades? I always just say palisade. Yeah, I, I think it's today. palisades, yeah. Palisades. Um, and everyone's got like a little wall and it looks tidy and it sort of protects the front of your house and you can have a little garden. He has taken up the entirety of the front, uh, obscuring the view from his own bay window downstairs, <laughs> his own front room. <clears throat> he has got a, a jet ski that takes the entire, and, and the actual, like, um, the rig that's underneath it that carries the, you know, carries the jet ski to the, the water. He's got, um, it takes up the whole spot. And then he's got, like, a big green <laughs> sort of gate um that that's like makes the house look absolutely insane with access required at all times on there <laughs> access required at all times what's the picture that he's got in the window is the it looks like the picture of his own jet ski yeah it could be and, it and, looks like the picture of his own house with a jet ski in the front it's absolutely bizarre and, and i think the drop curve i think he's done that himself mm. it doesn't look like a proper job does it I don't know. It, it looks like a proper job, but he's—I mean—he's encroaching on someone else's um, else's spot with his um, with his corn work as well. It's an astonishing thing to do to yourself for the sake of the lure of the water spot. <laughs> what, do, what, what do you reckon he looks like? I reckon he's an older bloke with like a, a, a ponytail, but he's receding. He ain't married. <laughs> <laughs> he was married. Oh no. Fine. She always said I couldn't do this. I'm doing it. No, I'm the, fucking doing the it. The last words he heard from his estranged wife were, of course. It's me or the jet ski. <laughs> he's definitely got. Oh, a, he's definitely got a scullet in a ponytail. To do keep us updated, uh, Stefan. Um, and like you knock say, on the door. Um, knock on the I'm, door I, under the auspices of some kind of market research and find out what the hell is going on. I'm su- I'm surprised that like, you know, you buy a house in a road that's you know it looks a certain way, and then he does that to his house. You're like, how is that allowed? I, I in that the words looks mad. in the words of Donald Trump. We need a full and total ban on jet skis until we can figure <laughs> out what the hell is going on here. <laughs> because, I mean, Ugh. that jet ski has not been used for some time either. No, no. It's an incredible it's, development. It's on. It's off the road. If, I tell you what, if someone did that in my street, I think I'd lose it. <laughs> I'd, I'd, just start, I'd just start messing with it, sugar in the gas tank. I'm, surpri- I'm actually quite surprised you don't have a jet ski. No, I always sort of like think that it's quite I, I an eighties thing skating. to have, isn't it? Yeah, I'd, I'd, I mean, it's basically just the scooter of the sea, really, isn't it? It's just, mm. it's just loud, obnoxious. But you live, you live by the sea. You could probably get get some use out of one, though. Yeah, but I'm not. Again, I don't, I, I don't have a parking space for the Jag. I don't, <laughs> I'm not going to start. Though we would have room for a jet ski in the front palisade. So yeah. If someone, if some, if you happened across on one of your many searches across eBay and the like, and you saw a jet ski mm. that was genuinely a bargain and it was close by, you do see them. You do. Would see you be them, tempted? Yeah. Would you like just have a little tinker, think... see how it worked, see what it looked like? I think I, th- oh, I'd love to have a have access to a jet ski, just cut around because like no one's like it's like. It's sort of like no one stops you doing it. Like as long as like you, they don't charge you launching fees, do they? You just sort of drive up, get on your jet ski, and start cutting around the place. It's great. Well, before you know it, you're in skiing. Miami. And before you, you know it, going. you're importing you're importing drugs for the cartels. <laughs> it's just like it's incredible. I think I think you'd have to get yourself a wetsuit though. That's something I'd like to see. Yeah, I've I've, I've jet ski. Last time I jet ski, I lost my I lost my glasses in the sea. Yeah, you I, I did. Yeah, so um. 
Yeah, I I'd, I think I'd quite like powerboarding. <laughs> quite get into the There's power something, scene. So I think I'm doing a powerboard podcast, Luke. If you're <laughs> yeah, I'd love to hear that. If you're in Monaco yeah. and you're mm. using a jet ski to get to your yacht, like it's quite mm. a glamorous thing. That's a glamorous. If thing, you're putting yeah. it in front of your terraced house in Exeter, mm. it somehow becomes the most depressing thing. <laughs> I wonder where it is. I wonder how close it is to the sea. Like he could push it with his own hands. <laughs> I mean, is Exeter near the sea? I don't even know. Exeter's near the sea, isn't it? It must be. He's got a jet ski. <laughs> Fig one, jet ski. <laughs> it's not actually that near the sea. It's, 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 there's a river. There's a river leading through it that leads to. Oh, it's quite near the sea, I suppose. Yeah, it is. Oh. Exeter. I just. just I, I would Exmouth. just. I would love to just take a big, like, t- take a big, uh, take a jet ski, some sa- not even sandwiches. Just, just go as far as I can and just have a lovely day on my jet ski, eating pemmican. <laughs> Why does it sound like? Oh. It's not like Michael from Alan Partridge. I just want to be. I just want to be as far away from people as <laughs> yeah, possible. I want to be the loneliest man in the world. Loneliest man in the world. I'd yeah. love to. I'd love to get a development from Stefan. Stefan, if you've got the um, the mm. courage to go and knock on the door, find out a bit more about it, please yeah. do so. If not, yeah. um, maybe just still. <laughs> imagine the if you just pull. Imagine you just pulled the. Uh, ask to buy it. Go there and ask to buy imagine it. Imagine if you just. Imagine you just pulled the cover off and yeah, he comes out and you sign it. Going yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> twisting the twisting the uh, oh, wheel. Pull the cover off. It's just completely made of cardboard. Yeah, it's like it's an uh, elaborate ruse it's, for the car it's park. Like Joy's space. Ferrari or Porsche or whatever the hell it just, was. Just um, Stefan, oh, yeah, ask yeah, him yeah. if you can buy it. Mm, we'll pitch okay. it. We'll do a just giving. Yeah. I, I mean, how much is a second-hand bloody... I bet it's like I bet it's like 500 quid. You know, it's a lot of money, but I mean, for, I, bet it's, I bet it's quite cheap. I bet, it, it, I bet it's like a non-runner. It's not been used for ages. So it's a jet ski, <laughs> there's jet skis on eBay at the moment. Mm. Like, decent. So there's one here. You don't know what a good jet ski is. I don't actually. Is. I, I stopped myself Stop saying pretending. that then. Yeah. Um, I'm going to go for <laughs> lowest price. Right. You can get a jet ski for, it looks like, about 1,400 quid. Mm-hmm. Um, Let's have a look. Yeah, some of them, some of them are quite. Um, so There's the one in my area. It's probably more. So like this one's a 2008 one. So it's 15 years old. And it's right. 1400 quid. Within, I'm going to go from where I am right now. Within one kilometer, is anyone selling a jet ski? <laughs> oh, that's quality. I bet they are. Someone's selling a boat, uh, a 1990 Wellcraft XL, um, for five grand. To be fair, it looks really nice. Get that. <laughs> it's just, but the thing is, I, I just never understand. It's, it looks like it's so far away from the water. It looks like it's on some farmland. Oh, dear. Anyway. It's good stuff. Anyway. You, you, it's just too much upkeep. Mooring fees, like anything in the sea is just too complicated. Fastest way to it. lose a million pounds, isn't it, by a yacht? Is it? That's what they say. Uh, anyway, if you've got a jet ski story, right. let us know. Why have yeah. we never talked about jet skis before? 650 quid a, two th- a year 2000 Sea Do RX. Right near my house. Lovely. 650? Oh, no, wait, you in, should get that bought. That You've one's in a, Birmingham. Ask that if, one's in Birmingham. They, that could listen, not be further away from get a sea. message out to them, sir. If they throw the trailer in as well, you'll buy it. Yeah, all right, cool. Sarah would be no delighted. Way, <laughs> Absolutely She wouldn't delighted. be surprised. We can put it in the back, yeah, back garden. Just sit on it. If I came by one so, day where we live with a, with, a, mm. with a newborn son with a jet ski, I think that'd be <laughs> curtains for me. I think that'd be it. That's all it takes. One jet ski. Yeah. That's your, you know, um, um, what was the um, in the divorce Paul papers? They just write jet ski. <laughs> Paul Simon song. There must be a thousand ways to leave your lover or whatever yeah. it is. Buy a new <laughs> jet one, ski. A thousand and one is a jet ski from eBay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>